changes around us. The old adage, there is nothing permanent except change, holds true even in the scientific world. Most of the things around us are changing all the time. We can classify these changes into physical and chemical depending on whether new substances are formed during the change or not. Let us look at some changes that happen in our daily life. What happens when you kick a football? Its position changes, but it still remains a football. It does not change into something new. The molecules that make the football also remain the same. Now, what happens when we tear a sheet of paper? The shape of the paper changes and it becomes smaller in size. But it still remains a paper. The molecules of the paper remain the same. In both these changes, no new substances are formed. The molecules of the substance remain exactly the same before and after the change. Such changes are called physical changes. Some physical changes such as tearing of a sheet of paper or sharpening of a pencil cannot be reversed. Once changed, you cannot bring back the original shape or size. However, most physical changes such as melting of ice and kicking of a football are temporary and can be easily reversed to return substances to their previous form. Let us now look at some more changes. What happens to the food we eat? The food is absorbed by our body and is used to nourish cells for growth. But the substances that make up a cell are different from the substances present in food. So, new substances are formed. When we boil an egg, it becomes hard and tastes different from a raw egg. The molecules of the egg change to make a new substance. In both these examples, new substances with different properties are formed. The molecules of the original substances undergo changes to form molecules of new substances. Such changes are called chemical changes. A chemical change occurs when there is a chemical reaction between the substances. In a chemical reaction, two or more substances react with each other to form new substances. The original substances are known as reactants. The new substances formed during or after the chemical reaction are known as products. Since new substances with different molecules are formed during chemical reactions, it is not easy to get back the original substances. Most chemical changes are, therefore, permanent and irreversible. Subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update.